So I know it's quite a bit after Christmas, but I was actually in Arizona visiting my family for Christmas. Um, I got a mom, a stepdad, and a little brother who live out there. I had the awesome pleasure of getting to go out there and visit with them. I figured I'd do a quick update. I had an awesome Christmas break. I got this robe, this wall print thingy. It's so relevant in our lives, so I'm glad that I got that. This book, I highly recommend it. This Wii U, yeah, my mom totally spoils us kids. Uh, I'm so blessed to have gotten that. This geeky t-shirt, Rayman Legends. This cat, Pikmin 3, this is actually my girlfriend's. This uh, parallel Bible, it's King James Version and Amplified Version. This book by Chuck Missler and a bunch of other stuff. Thank you so much to everybody who like blessed me with these awesome gifts, especially this guy. I should give you some details. This is Olimar. Olimar is actually the name of the captain in the original Pikmin. Hi, Olimar. Ah! On Christmas Day, my little brother and I actually did a Christmas bro down challenge. What does that mean? Well, check this out. Hello everybody, what's up? This Hi. is my brother Samuel, Word. and we thought that we would do a Christmas bro down challenge. See, Christmas. <laughs> we got Christmas. these very not Christmas themed hats, but mine keeps like giving me these <laughs> nasty freaking sparkles all over my body. At least it matches your shirt. Yeah. Christmas games, Christmas dinner challenge. Oh boy. Which will be fun. Christmas birth. exercise after dinner challenge. Christmas birth. Birth of new life. What? <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, be ready. It's going to be good. Oh! So our first challenge is going to be Christmas games. I would imagine like zero of you know what this thing is or you watch QVC but it is a flash pad 2.0. You turn it on and you get this really annoying music but it's awesome and um, <laughs> it's got all these games on it and you can do one or two players we're just gonna do single player the only one that really matters the most is chase me I'll just give you a quick sample these red ring of death looking circles light up and you have to press them you can't press the green ones which seems really backwards from what you would expect anyways but if you don't do it fast enough, it ends your game. We'll do Sam first, because he's the youngest. What was that? 536. I believe that was my best score ever. So, <laughs> one for the brawl down. No, stop it. <laughs> I must have tapped it with the side of my hand. No! <laughs> Alright, so Sam wins that one. Okay, so for our next challenge, we are going to be the challenge of new life slash birth. <laughs> so, on my new Hui Yu, we'll be creating a me. <laughs> our mom has something to do with this. We're both going to make a me on the Wii U. So, one of us will start in this room making the me. Now the other will be out of the room, not seeing what kind of faces we use. <laughs> My girlfriend's got this grin on her face that makes me think she's up to something really ornery. But anyways, we're going, the, the idea is to make the best looking mom. The best looking mom possible, most accurate to mom. Then we're going to have mom come in and judge him. Why is, why are you laughing? What have you done? <laughs> I can't get it out. <laughs> Quick recap. So, Wii U. 
We're gonna make our beautiful mother on the Wii U. And whoever makes the most beautiful one, according to Madre, will win this challenge. Okay. And we will not be able to see each other's work, so we can't be like, Oh, he used a blue shirt? Well, I'm going to use one, too. <laughs> I, uh... <laughs> mom won't know who did what. This is my mom. <laughs> She's not happy about being on the camera right now. No. But, anyways. These... She will not know who did what. She's gonna pick which one she likes best. Today is December 25th, 2013, and I got up and didn't put any makeup on. So that's why I look the way I do. Please overlook my appearance and please see my heart. <laughs> also, I would like to say that I am the proud and loving mother of Caleb Josiah Nisley and Samuel Michael Rooney. I do not like picking one or the other. Therefore, I apologize beforehand for any hurt feelings that may occur in the process of my helping them with whatever. Thank you. You pick oh my lefty. Goodness. The one on the far left is Sam. That doesn't count. <laughs> lefty or righty. I absolutely like the lefty for sure better, but the righty looks a lot like me because I wear my hair up all the time, but I don't wear my glasses hardly ever. So this is really hard. I'm going with the, the girl with her hair down. Oh, I don't know what to do. I would have chosen the one with the hair up if he wasn't wearing glasses. So which one is it? The one in the middle. All right, that's mine. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. Sam won the last challenge, so now we're all tied up. I so feel... you did justice. How does no, it feel? No, I didn't. I didn't do justice. How does I... it feel to do justice? I hurt my son. <laughs> no, you didn't. No, you didn't. <laughs> you did. All right, our next challenge is the Christmas dinner challenge, where Sam and I both are allotted two slices of bread and we get to make whatever sandwich that we please. And then Sherea is going to, that's my girlfriend, she is going to taste test these things. And this is like a multi-point special round because... There's creativity, there's style, there's <laughs> taste. It's like one big Sonic the Hedgehog sandwich point. Yeah, that. And <laughs> so, so she'll base it, <laughs> she'll base it off of if like which one tastes better which one has better style which i don't even know what that means but i guess we'll find out when she picks one and, and then which one is the most creative but there is a stipulation <laughs> if she refuses to eat a sandwich because it is just too far-fetched weird or completely it nasty it has to be a crazy sandwich <laughs> if she just like absolutely refuses to eat it she's allowed to do that and that person automatically is disqualified for the flavor round so <laughs> that'll be him <laughs> maybe all right so that's how that's going to work all righty guys so this is the food portion where i make a sandwich caleb will make one too but yeah so uh what do we got here we are running out of battery that's no good okay so we've got provolone cheese, American cheese, ham, mustard, uh, mustard, mayonnaise, kale crunch, olives, chocolate covered almonds, sugar coated pecans, normal pecans, and honey and bread. Um, hopefully this turns out good. I'll give you an update midway through or so. <laughs> so what I've got here is my sandwich. I have two low, two slices of bread. On one slice is mayonnaise, on one slice is mustard. <clears throat> and then on the slice with the mayonnaise, there is provolone cheese. And then two pieces of American cheese, but wrapped in the American cheese is pecans. And then on the side with the mustard, there is ham. <laughs> I'm forgetting what I even put on here. Honey, a little spritz of kale crunch. And I believe that was it. Then I threw a sugar-coated pecan 
and a chocolate covered almond in there, threw an olive on top, and then put some fancy diddly mustard kale on the side. Now, that's yummy gross. I would eat it, but we'll see if Shrey will. I feel like obligated as Shrey's boyfriend not to make her a normal sandwich. So I did, it is a little weird, but I have, it, it's not gonna be as weird as Sam's, but hopefully we will win the flavor one. Otherwise, I'm in big trouble in this competition. Let's get started. So here are my ingredients. Got some Fig Newtons, blueberry. This banana is questionable. Got some honey, peanut butter, some mixed nuts, bread, and pecans. I feel like I should get a bonus for doing this because I'm actually gonna film me making it and it's gonna have to be mostly one-handed. Add uh, the bread. Might not want to let uh, Shreya actually watch these videos. This banana is a little questionable. If this is too rotten, <laughs> we won't put it on the sandwich. Yeah, I've seen worse. <laughs> She's gonna know it was the banana sitting on the counter. My honest goal is not to make her sick. It's just disappointing to know these parts are kind of brown. Disappointing to know that Sam's sandwich has to be infinitely funnier than this one. Mmm, just like grandma makes it good. She doesn't like ridiculous amounts of condiments like me. Not that honey is really a condiment, but put a decent amount of honey on there. She's gonna watch this and be like, ew, too much honey. She likes pecans, but I don't know how good pecans are on a sandwich, Christmas sandwich. Christmas, Christmas sandwich, time of year, eat the sandwich with some cheer. Oh, it is beautiful. I, I forgot all about peanut butter. <laughs> How am I going to put, uh, mom might not like that. Next, this stuff. Trail mix. <laughs> I, I feel like if I come up with some, like, awesome name for this, like, the Nutty Trail Honey Sandwich. She, that is not an awesome name. This actually is probably gonna be like <laughs> really awesome, but it might be too much nuts. Maybe we'll tone that down with some peanut butter. Peanut butter. Wondrous splendiferous peanut butter honey sandwich. Not really, <laughs> not winning any style contest. That's for sure. Let's take a look at the inside. Hmm. Oh, bon appetit. I really don't think this is gonna be nearly as bad as it looks. It looks like a scrambled egg cookie nasty sandwich. She might not eat this, I might be disqualified. <laughs> See some ham, some pecans, some kale chips, multiple variety of cheese, some creepy sauces. Okay. And a beautiful olive to decorate it. We also have some kale chip crunch and some mustard to decorate the plate. And maybe some honey. <laughs> I'm thinking, I'm kind of scared to eat this. Style points. This one has a definite style to it. Because there's this little beautiful poop mound over here. And also like the, the olive. Professionals do like to have like little green stuff yeah. and then drizzle. So, I'm going to give this 
a four out of five. <laughs> Do you want a close-up of this mask? Let's get a close-up. Oh, <laughs> mm, it looks good. Mysterious black things. Uh, yeah. Okay, here it goes. Okay. <laughs> it's crunchy. <laughs> Very crunchy. <laughs> but the ham and the pecans complement each other along with the honey. All right, I assume this is Sam's. So for taste, I'm gonna give it a 3.5. And for creativity, <coughs> I know that it's pretty much everything in the house. I'm gonna go with a three. 10.5. 10.5 total on that one. Samuel. I like the bow, it's very festive. I really like the packaging. Mm -hmm. It's beautiful. I'm gonna give style points 3.5. It's sick. <laughs> it's coming out of it. <laughs> okay, we need to take a look inside. This is more of a dessert. <laughs> oh, it looks I delicious. Think. What is it? Okay, there's, okay, there's kale. That's grown. I don't see kale. Is that green? Oh, that's black, so. Oh, this is out of the trail mix. Mm. The blueberries. Mm. Peanut butter. Pecans, whatever this is, muffin, goodness, what is this? <laughs> you requested that I tell you nothing. Banana. I taste banana. Oh, you use that rotten. <laughs> it's not. It's not rotten. There is not a rotten banana in there. There is not a rotten banana that in there. Black. That was black. Like it was not. A, <laughs> that's not rotten. You put Samuel's Christmas I, present I, is <laughs> disqualified. I examined the banana pieces carefully. I only select the finest ingredients. Okay. I'm going to take my first bite. Mmm. That's good. I'm going to go with a 4.5 for taste for this. 4.5 for taste. Oh. It's good. I don't believe the creativity was very creative. <laughs> How is it not creative? It's a dessert sandwich. It's a breakfast cereal honey sandwich. It's a honey boo boo lovely <laughs> you're my boo boo honey sandwich. I'm gonna give creativity a 2.5. What? <laughs> so what's that total out to? A 10.5. What'd Sam get? 10.5. Oh my gosh, a tie. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> All right, so our next challenge is to walk off our wonderful dinner that we didn't even eat yet, <laughs> but whatever. Our 3DSs have a feature on them where they actually count the steps you do. It gives you a little token. How many steps are you at currently? 745. All right, I'm at 1,052 currently for the day. So we're going to put these in our pockets. Go ahead. Whoever gets the most steps after Sheree says go, when she says stop, we come back, we'll walk back gently and check and see whoever made the most improvement, um, then that person wins. Ready, set, go. <laughs> One thousand one hundred fifty-nine. Eight hundred and forty-six. So Caleb has merged the victor in our bro down challenge, and we have decided that the loser will have to combine both of the sandwiches and eat the an amount. <laughs> And the winner gets the honking piece of chocolate cake. Aye, aye, aye. But, you know, these were good earlier, these sandwiches. But the problem is they've been out here for like three hours now, outside, exposed. <laughs> this is all flavors. Look at that. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> 
smells like banana. <laughs> banana. It's got a banana in there that's not rotten. <laughs> it's rotten. It's not. It was my Christmas rotten. present. <laughs> <laughs> It's <laughs> just raw. <laughs> it just looks raw. I feel horrible. It tastes like gooey banana and peanut butter. Merry Christmas, Gamer Faith Warriors. I oh. hope you enjoyed our little special <laughs> run out. Sam is like <laughs> showing me things I never wanted to see over here. And I hope you had a great Christmas yourself. Whoa. <laughs> <And, laughs> <laughs> I think that's a wrap. Hamson tastes like banana. <laughs>